Let us join together in prayer. Gracious God, we join together in hearts today, celebrating Palm Sunday, recalling when your son Jesus entered Jerusalem with a crowd of people, all who were waving palms and singing Hosanna. The events of Palm Sunday and Holy Week evoke a wide range of emotions and feelings, from happiness and rejoicing to sorrow and sadness. Bless us today, and as we enter the days ahead of us, we will need your power and presence to surround and support us as we move through these difficult days together. Remind us, God, to take moments this week to seek and find glorious glimpses of you. May days lengthened by light and warmed by the sun encourage us to go outside to watch for robins, to witness the forsythia in full yellow bloom, and take walks, breathing in and giving thanks for the beauty of our world. Remind us, God, that although we are practicing social distancing to help stop the spread of this virus, we can continue to spread kindness. We can pick up the phone and call a church member, family, or friend. We can use our time and talents to make prayer shawls or masks. We can make trips to grocery stores or pharmacies for those who are compromised. We can send cards or notes to brighten someone's day. We can spread kindness. We pray for all who enter Holy Week with heavy hearts and worried minds. We long for the day when this pandemic begins to subside. We pray for those who are lonely, for those who are sick, and for those who are afraid. May they feel your guiding presence. We pray for the medical professionals, the doctors, the nurses, the first responders, and all the volunteers who are devoted to saving lives. May they feel your guiding presence. We pray for those who have lost jobs, lost their sense of direction, and have lost hope. May they feel your guiding presence. May they know that together we will get through this. Hear the prayers that we are silently carrying close to our hearts. These prayers and all the prayers on our hearts we offer in faith as we pray the words you taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Amen. <laughs> 